Uh, these two young ladies are taking a course in sociology, Johnny. They were sent to be to help them with their field work. Sociology, huh? Well, let's see now. Oh, it's a study of social conditions. Seeing how the other half lives. I mean, uh, things like crime. Uh, well, you understand what I mean, Mr. Eager. <laughs> I get it. How's your schoolwork coming on, Matilda? Oh, fine. I love it. That's good. Uncle Johnny's helping me with my homework. You see, Mr. Eager's really not Matilda's uncle. She just calls him that. Her father was married to Mrs. Fowler, who's Johnny's cousin. Isn't that right, Johnny? Uh, yeah, 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 that's right. Yeah, Matt was a great guy. We were in business together. You mean he's not living now? He was killed in an automobile. Oh. It's terrible, these automobile accidents. This was on purpose by some rats with a sawed-off shotgun. <laughs> Matilda. Here, here, here now, kid. You, uh, you really can't blame her. She gets pretty riled up about it. Of course. We were going to drop in on some of the other boys, Johnny, but when Miss Sanford heard about you, she particularly wanted to visit here. You did? Why? Oh, my name is Bart. She's Sanford. Oh. Oh, yes. As a matter of fact, Liz didn't want to come at all. Did you, Liz? No. Why not? Well, I... I think it's rather an imposition. I mean, it's rather embarrassing to have us come in this way. I'm very sorry. Ah, don't be. I'm glad you came. When you've been where I've been, you can never get enough company. Thanks. Uh, Matilda, what is your homework? What? Oh, um, we've got to pick out some famous character fiction and uh, write an essay on uh, something they said. Oh? Have you decided on anybody? Why, uh, no. We can't think of a good one. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's kind of tough. I know. What about in Tale of Two Cities, where Sidney Carton was in jail and... Uh, no, that's no good. There's that speech I always like in Cyrano de Bergerac, when Cyrano is telling Roxanne the meaning of a kiss. Yeah, what's that? The kiss, he said. I do not see why your lips do not dare one. It is the divine secret which one mouth tells the other while neither needs to listen. It is the pilgrimage of the heart across the lips to the soul. Cyrano, huh? Well, I'll go for that. What do I read about the guy? I, I guess the girl said yes, huh? No. No, he was making love for Christian, his best friend. He sent Christian to receive the kiss. Why? What was his angle? Well, you see, he was afraid. He was very ugly. Oh. What's wrong? You're not going to read it? No. Ugly or not, I'm not interested in a guy that doesn't go through with what he starts. <laughs> 